It's CBC Kids Book Club. Gary the Unicorn here, and I'm hanging out with my awesome author pal, Louise Zimini, here at the Richmond Hill Public Library. Hi, Gary. Hi, everyone. Yeah, and guess what? Louise brought her book for us to read called Walking Together. And Louise, you, you wrote the story with Elder Albert D. Marshall, and it was illustrated by Emily K. Wageshik. In our story, you're going to hear the words, when we walk together in a good way. It's a Mi'kmaq idea shared by others as well. And it means when we walk together, our actions should always be in harmony and in balance with the land. Why, you know what, I really love that idea, Louise. When we walk together in a good way, things are revealed. We hear those who are returning and those who have stayed sing the lands and the waters awake after a deep rest. Oh, a deep rest is like, like an alarm clock. Okay, uh, beep, 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 beep. Come on, wake up, nature. Beep, 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 spring is here. Beep, 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 beep. Uh, you have to press the uh, snooze button. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, perfect. When we walk together in a good way on Turtle Island, we learn we are all connected. We are never alone. Together we are strong. Strong, so strong. <laughs> yeah, <clears throat> yeah, feel, feel those, yeah, feel those muscles. <clears throat> so strong. <laughs> When we walk together in a good way, we go to what we love. We take only if there's enough. Oh, you know what, that is so true. You know what, nature counts on us to take care of it. So we should only take what we need and leave nature better than when we found it. And when we take care of the land and water, the land and water take care of us. Oh, what a lovely letter to nature, Louise. Oh, eh, thanks for reading your story with us. And I would walk together with you any day. Aw, me too. <laughs>